Hello everyone. About two months ago, I uh, initiated some water propagation on two of my plants. Uh, I have this uh, Tradescentia zebrina here and this Senecio crassissimus over here. And yeah, I mean, I just had it uh, in this old honey jar and I refreshed the water about once a week, but apart from this, I didn't really do much. And now looking at this uh, jar, there are quite a few forms, uh, roots have formed. Can you see this? So I think it really is time to uh, finally uh, pl uh, plant these uh, cuttings in a little bit of soil. And the only thing you need to really do at this stage, so you have the cutting, you put it into water, some roots have formed, you, know, you will just, yeah, you will take a pot, you, I filled it with some soil, and then you need to make sure that the, so, uh, that the soil is moist, because otherwise it's too much of a shock for the plant that uh, has basically stood in water for the last couple of weeks, and now uh, all of a sudden, uh, just to get used to like slightly drier um, environments. So yeah, don't make it too hard on the plant. May, uh, ensure that the soil is uh, moist. Yeah, and this is what I'm gonna do. It's pretty simple. So I will start with the uh, Senecio crassissimus. Let's take a look at the root system. Looks pretty healthy to me. Yes, and now I will place the roots in the soil. Yes, and this is the result. And yeah, uh, this uh, Senecio is going to turn a little bit purple. So at the moment it's very green because it had uh, got so much water. But uh, can you see these uh, purple ends of the, uh, of the leaf? This is what uh, it's going to look like. Yeah, I'm gonna do the same uh, to the Tradescentia. You can see the roots again. They formed under uh, the nodes. Yeah, and I will place them. Yeah, and Tradescentias are usually quite nice when they spill over a little bit, so you can lean them to the side a little bit. So, quite a simple process, and you just need a little bit of patience when you do water propagation. And I'm very much uh, looking forward to see how they're going to grow. Um, yeah, and if, if the soil isn't uh, moist yet, make sure to water it and uh, check on it like every two to three days, whether the soil is still moist, uh, not completely wet, but moist, and then you should be fine. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you soon. Bye bye.